Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Kaylee Ota. And I'm Erin Milanes. Today is Monday, September 9th, and we are here with your morning announcement. Homecoming float building is this week. Come to build to compete for the title of winning float for your class. Freshmen in HP7 with Ms. Morlock, sophomores in HD5 with Ms. Heron and Ms. Gonzalez, juniors in HP10 with Ms. Corbin, and seniors in HD3 with Ms. Wright. Want to be a positive change in your community? Are you interested in making CEO a better version of itself? Come join us in Ms. Bear's room, HL7, from 3.30 to 4.30 in September 17th for a CEO house meeting. Don't forget to attend as it will be complete all paperwork that day. Coach Fow is holding preseason wrestling meetings this week in his room in HG3 immediately after school. Each meeting lasts about 10 minutes and he will also discuss preseason after school weight training and wrestling sessions. The sessions are held each day, Monday through Thursday after school until 5 p.m. through October 10th. Martial Arts Club will have you meet every Tuesday in the cardio room from 3.30 to 4.30. Come and, come and join for immersing yourself into the world of martial arts and learn how to defend yourself. Now let's check out our counseling announcements. Students in all grades, if you plan to attend a four-year college but you don't know where you want to go to school, this opportunity is perfect for you. On Wednesday, October 16th, Elk Grove Unified School District will host a college and career fair at Thorn High School. You will be able to get information from representatives of California four-year colleges, state colleges and private, CSUs and UCs, local community colleges, and also meet with military recruiters. On Saturday, September 14th, the Historically Black College and University Fair will be held at Monterey Trail High School. The HBCU College Fair hours are 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. This college-going event is open to all EGUSD students. Seniors, bring your transcripts. Application fee waivers and on-the-spot admissions are possible. Check your August 27th email from Ms. Caldwell in the Career Center for a link to register. For juniors and seniors, college presentations at CUHS are another great opportunity to get information from colleges about their campus, programs, and what they're looking for in applicants. We will have more than 25 colleges coming over the next two months. We will announce these on Wolfpack TV. Email the information and post on our school's website calendar. Sign-ups are always in the Career Center. Visiting this week is Grand Canyon University on Tuesday, September 10th. Visiting next week are, on Wednesday, the 18th, Concordia University, Point Loma Nazarene, and Hawaii Pacific University. Thursday, the 19th, William Jessup University and Boise State. Friday, the 20th, UC Santa Barbara. You can sign up for any of these presentations in the Career Center. Seniors, if you will be applying to four-year colleges, you must take the SAT or the ACT. Your counselors encourage you to take both. Why? because you won't know which test you'll score higher on until you take both the SAT and the ACT. However, be sure to check if the colleges you want to apply to require the written portion. Colleges have no preference which exam you take, they just want you to have a good score. Need more info? You can pick up a flyer in the Career Center or from your counselor. If you think you qualify for a fee waiver, see Ms. Caldwell in the Career Center. Juniors and freshmen, if you're planning to attend a four-year college after graduation, you are strongly encouraged to take the PSAT. National Merit Scholars and Scholarships are determined through junior year PSAT scores. This year the PSAT will be held on October 16th. The PSAT is on sale now and may be purchased at the student store at lunch or after school at the counselor's window. The cost, $18. We have a limited number of fee waivers for juniors, so if you think you qualify for a fee waiver, see Ms. Caldwell in the Career Center for an application right away. And sophomores, the school district has paid for all sophomores to take the PSAT. You will receive information about this test in APO. Juniors and seniors, the ASVAB test will take place on Thursday, October 31st. The ASVAB is the military entrance exam and it is free. Taking it in high school will prepare you for taking it at the recruiting office for placement in the military. If you don't plan on joining the armed forces, it is still helpful to assess your strengths and identify possible career choices. Sign up in the Career Center to take it. Thanks, Francesca. This Wednesday, September 11th, a workshop will cover using California colleges to apply for college and choose a major. Workshops are held in the Career Center and begin at 8 a.m. No need to sign up, just show up. But get there early, seating is limited. 
GAs and seniors, Grand Canyon University will be here tomorrow, September 10th. GCU is a Christian college, college located in Phoenix, Arizona. You don't have to be Christian to attend as they welcome all. Please sign up in the Career Center to get your pass. Before we go, let's check out a quick informational video about IMCO. So the program PBIS is a district initiative and it's been around for the last five or so years. Um, we did rebrand it as IMCO because we wanted to make it our own here at our school. IMCO is to um, create a community, also to um, reward students for um, positive behavior and to make sure they're encouraging them to be their best selves. I hope that it will bring us together, um, students and staff and staff and students, to build relationships, long-lasting relationships, and also to make this campus a better place. So, you can receive an IMCL ticket by exemplifying one of our uh, four words. We have honorable, respectful, responsible, or engaged. Um, and if you're doing those things, teachers should be handing out IMCO tickets. Um, staff has them, um, paraeducators have them, principals have them, and also cafeteria and security. So, anyone seeing you do that, doing those four words should be able to give you a ticket. When you get a ticket, you can redeem them in my room. I have tons of school supplies for the white tickets. You can also come spin the wheel outside at lunch every Thursday um, for the white tickets. The yellow portion, which is the back part of the ticket, you can turn in for the raffle that we have at the end of the month. Time Shield is a great program. We hope everyone gets involved. We hope all the students this year get at least one ticket and they come out and see us at lunch on Thursdays. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Marie Milanes. And I'm Pelia. To remember the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Have, have a, a musical, musical Monday, Monday Wolfpack. Wolf Did you say oh. wolf?